Hello and welcome to a new episode of Bounty of One. Today we are going to try to beat the game with Ollie again because last time it didn't work quite well. Um, and uh, yeah, we, we actually died. So we, we'll hope that we can manage it today. And um, yeah, just get into a game right away. So yeah, um, I haven't played the game again since last time really. <clears throat> Maybe I should play it a little bit more. But yeah, it's still, I mean, it's super fun. Yeah, I don't know. I think it's nicer to have this effect like every time when we, we record a session. And yeah, um, today I'm probably going to cut it a little bit more together this time. To, so you guys uh, doesn't don't have to watch like a 40 minutes long episode. Um, but if you would like to have a 40 minutes long episode, I can do that again in the future. It's, uh, I mean, it's all up to you guys, to be honest. Um, but I think it's better when I cut it together a little bit with uh, a few of the most important moments or uh, essential moments. Uh, let's get a little bit more speed here. Okay, nice. Well, um, well, that, that help sheriff is a little bit annoying, to be honest, to deal with you right now. Since we don't have anything. So, oh, ability cooldown, I'll take that happily. Do you guys know? Oh, wait, no. If he's close to me, he gets faster. I got it. Okay. Yeah, more cooldown reduction is great. Like that early on. That's nice. If we get, like, more damage now, too, it would be crazy. <laughs> um, I don't know. Hello? Can we can we get some damage, please? I, I, one thing that I'm asking with, uh, myself with Ollie every time is, does he get... Like, does his ability increase an explosive... Like, explosion size? I don't know if it's really an explosion. It's just the arrows, right? Um, so not any enemy they touch. Uh, I mean... Show inventory objects. Oh, we can now look in our inventory? That's crazy. Wow. Your projector slow down any enemies that touch... They touch by 70... Okay, let's do that. That sounds good. Sounds good to me soon. Not what I want, really, but hey, it's fine. Increase your chance of dealing critical damage by 7%. They, they nerfed it. It's a little bit weird. Gain more attack speed. Gain more damage. I think we need more damage right now. They nerfed critical damage. Okay, I like crits in general. Okay, well. It's weird. I'd say, but I mean, it was pre-OP. Everybody, like, went crit. Crit is just, was just the way to go every time. I don't know if I added even more items. Uh, piercing? No, we don't want piercing. Um, I still trying to sort of area effect to pick up range. Let's go with that. I just want to test it out a little bit, you know. A little bit of area is definitely not bad. If we get an area effect, that would be great, right? I mean, onion would be nice. So... <clears> hmm. <throat> chance of dealing more damage. Trace this range, the chance of... Okay. Hmm. Uh... This is hard. Um, raise the range of area. Okay, wait. Well, let's go with that. We we gonna get area effect like one hundred percent, probably. I, like I would be very happy about vampire right now. Look at that. There's like three hearts that we could pick up. We get like a ton of damage. Like also with Gatling gun, it like stacks super nicely too. We get like Gatling gun on top. Damn. Good. Let's take this. <clears throat> Vampire, come on. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Lightning strike, small area damage. That's I mean, that's nice. We would out of dash gain 20% movement speed, 100% crit damage, and plus 10% damage. Okay, one aura that slows down enemies. We don't need that. Let's go with the lightning strike. Because we do it. We did increase our area effect damage, so it's gonna deal a little bit more damage in area, right? So that's kind of nice. Okay. Oh, that also got nerfed by 50%. Okay, so crit got, like, uh, uh, nerfed a lot. Crazy. We can actually just run and deal damage now, which is kind of nice. If we increase our area, the, uh, like, area size even more, that would be kind of nuts. Uh, cooldown. Yeah, let's go that. Please give it to me. Game frame reroll of upper choices. Okay. Object choices, um, oh, when we are at 50% HP, we do more damage. So, more movement speed sounds actually nice now. Uh, so...
time. You can just run around and deal damage, which is very nice <laughs> and convenient. Uh, okay, more oh, ability cooldown, nice. Then, oh wow, in that case it is gonna be cooldown that is like uh, the, the meters, which is the cooldown on this ability, so actually gonna be more than like less than two meters, I think. I'm not sure if it works like that, but that's how I expect it to work. I don't know. <clears> there <throat> was a little bit of a hassle. Okay, come on, vampire. Give me vampire. Uh, I bounce two more times. Projects that. Oh, no, nah, this is bad. All the troop behind you. Mm -mm -mm -mm. That's gr Yeah, that should be nice, actually. Of course. So. More area effect, let's go. Thought our explosion radius is gonna be bigger. I mean, I actually see the explosion. Look at that. Boop, boop, boop. I would like to attract some resources, please. Oh, God. We are locked in here. Okay, well, it's plus two HP, let's go. I'll take that. So, I don't know if we have a good level or a bad level, to be honest, at this point. Okay. More area effect, let's go. 100% now. <clears throat> yeah, we can actually just run around, it's gonna deal damage. What an intense boss fight, guys. <laughs> <gasps> oh my god, okay. Poison would be also awesome on us, I think, this time. Poison would be great, actually. Can you finally die, please? Die, thank you very much, senpai. So. Good. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, this is fucking bad. So, Onion is very nice. But Gatling Gun is... Damn. <laughs> uh, but for Gatling Gun, we have to stay still. We don't want to stay still. We're going to go with Onion. And Onion also has this cooldown reduced, so it's going to deal so much damage. We just need more damage now, to be honest. We don't need any attack speed. I mean, just need damage, flat damage now. So give me the XP, guys. Come on, I need the levels. Please, please, please. Thank you very much. Give me red coins, blue coins, green coins. I don't know. Whatever you want me to get, like, whatever you want to give them to me, just give it to me. Okay. Will you cool down? Raise your health. Reduce the cooldown of dashes and abilities by 10%. Um, yeah. We need more damage. We cannot take the meat this time because we want to have a little bit more speed. Uh, and if I take it, we have less movement speed, so we shouldn't take that <clears throat> if we get it. Even though it's one of the best items in my opinion, but you know. Okay, well, that's an easy one. More damage. So, okay. Uh, let's see. What are we getting? Oh, oh, oh. You reload all your dash slots at once. Penalty gain. More da attack, uh, like more damage, but reduces your attack speed. That's actually fine, to be honest. Uh, reloading all our dash at once doesn't do any more things for us, to be honest. Oh my god! <clears throat> Shoots an explosive grenade towards the nearest enemy. Ooh. Get yeah, 10% more experience from fruit and past coins. How many levels would we get from that? Oh, this is a hard one, because this is a cooldown ability, and uh, but I don't know how much damage it would be, but it has also an area effect, so it would be a, l a big, like, AoE damage, right? That's also not bad, but yeah, no, we don't need that. Gain 10% more experience from fruit and past coins. I think that would give us three levels or something, or four. What do you guys think? Oh, I think I'm gonna go with this one. It only gave me one level. Oh my god. <laughs> So bad. Oh no. Okay, well, this is great actually, though. 
I'm getting more XP. Bro, we need Vampire so badly. Look at all the hearts. Look at all these hearts. You would get, like, so much damage. But our area effect, holy shit, is that huge. It looks like that the dash from the stonies, uh, from the stone people there, um, actually goes up with their movement speed. Um, or down with their, like, scales with movement speed. Because it didn't dash very far when I hit it. Okay, that's actually a hard choice now. I'm gonna go with movement speed. How many do you give me, um, the chest right now? Okay. Nice. Let's go, let's see what we get. We got, ooh, ooh, five. Well, we don't need that. You have any pierce? I think should be destroyed. Pierce, okay. Getting armor that protects you from one hit is crazy for me. Because the cooldown is going to be reduced. So I'm actually, like, invincible now. So, more area effect. Cool. So, we need another Shara, please. Ah, I got hit. But it's fine, because we have a shield. It's gonna be back in like 20 seconds. Okay, more damage. Let's take it. That's a lot of bullets. Oh my god. You are going to give me vampire, right? You are like a vampire lord. You look like a vampire lord to me. So... Oh, I got hit. But it doesn't matter. We have our shield. Can we... Focus! Ah! Okay. <sighs> More damage. We're lacking damage right now. Like, heavily. Um... Can we kill it before the mole comes? Because we're gonna have the boss fight soon. Okay, nice. Vampire, please, 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 please. Aw, oh, I was almost happy. <laughs> Uh, deal. Uh, uh, yeah, that doesn't do anything. Attract all around you when you're limited to beauty. No, it doesn't do anything. Doesn't do anything either. So we're gonna go with the crit now. So now we get like 100% crit every time we dash. Okay. All right, don't stand behind him. Standing behind him is death. Okay. I should stand right next to him, actually. That was stupid. Um, mm -mm -mm -mm. No! Ah. Okay. This is the longest milk fight I ever had, I think. Holy shit. Takes a real long time. The Undertaker will be fun, guys. <laughs> um, if we don't get enough more damage, it's gonna be very crazy. Okay. So, last dive for him. Alright, and it's dead. Nice. Vampire, please! Give me vampire, please! Give me vampire! Oh, no. Each time uh, you dash, take one damage, but your penalty gain plus 10 D full damage. Max number of gains, 15. That is crazy. But we do have 100% crit now on dashing, so I don't know. Uh, this is a hard one. It would give us more damage, and we would just have to run the whole time, to be honest. Huh. I'll be able to lose the 100% um, crit. Is it worth it though? I think it is, to be honest. So, because we do have so many hearts lying around, we gotta use them. You know? They're gonna scale up our damage like crazy now. Wait, does the shield like, actually block it? Wait. Give me a second. That wouldn't actually cheese it so hard. Let's see. Can we cheese it? We can. Okay, crazy. Okay, I don't have to do it with the hearts, actually. But we do have still a chance to get... Um, to get uh, the wonderful, wonderful vampire perk. To pick up all the hearts and get, like, tons of damage. We do deal a lot of damage, though. Without critting and everything, too. Like, it's crazy. So, 
give me more damage now. We don't need the movement speed, I think. Race D, okay. Hmm. Yeah, we think I think flat damage is now our the thing that we should go. Too, up, too many hearts, but we also don't want to lose any hearts, to be honest, so... Okay. Okay, nice. Come on. Give me the vampire poke, please. There's so many hearts. Shit. No vampire. Um... 20% more damage. Oh, credit next close each time. Four times your damage upon taking damage. That's crazy, to be honest, to a force. Hmm. The shields are very good protective-wise, like, you know. 20% damage is, like, crazy on us, too. Like, <laughs> 60? Oh, my God. This is nuts. It's crazy, actually. So. Bounce ones. Oh. That's... Uh, nah, we don't need it. Gain more attack damage. That seems maybe not bad. Hmm. I don't know. Gain more attack damage, uh, attack speed, gain more movement speed. Uh, more attack speed. Uh, more movement speed, more movement speed, come on. Bro, we are so fast. Crazy. So, are we at the max already? Like, when it comes out to damage? And, um, how many times did I use it now? Did I get the max gains already? How do, how do we have, have we achieved it? Um, when your protector should be destroyed, is it for damage by 50%? No, we don't need that. Whenever you take two damage in a row, heal for two. It's crazy. Let's go. So, if I take two damage in a row, so it means if I dash twice now. I get healed. Crazy. And we got 30 damage. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, we're doing so much damage now. That's crazy, actually. Just by running around, people get damage. So. More area effect. Crazy. It's actually crazy, so. We gotta pick up all the materials, though. So, okay, the Undertaker fight might be not as hard as I thought it would be. We do need the Vampire Poke, we have so many hearts here. Okay, let's see. We're not getting any damage anymore, okay, so dashing is now unnecessary. Okay. Hello, mister. Could you just please give me what I want? Give me vampire. I need more scaling. Please. 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 Please, 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 please. Hmm. Slowing down enemies. Game one dash plus 30% second cooldown. Dash cooldown. That doesn't matter for us, really. It would remove the damage, actually. That would be not bad. But you know, grenades. Grenades, guys. How does this work, the grenades? Oh, I just froze them randomly. They're oh, crazy. Oh my god. Wait, this is nuts. Holy shit. Well, we do have a full running build, guys, at this point. Don't have to do anything anymore. Just collect the coins. Oh, we got hit. <laughs> Faster than the speed of light. I'm using bolt. Like vampire would like give us like 50, 60 more damage, like plus the percentage up, so we would like get 100 more damage, I think, for all the hearts that are lying around. The, do the pewters only spawn like every cycle? I don't actually know how it works. 
There'll be something interesting to know. So please, guys, if you know, write it in the comment section. That'd be very, very helpful. Thank you very much. These ones are actually pretty tanky. Perfect. Collectible from further away. Get okay, let's remove the healing um, the damage effect from us, pretty much. We don't have enough money, guys. We need more money. Blue coins, yeah. Let's go. I am the Undertaker, okay. Let's see how we can deal with it. Oh, we got close, then close to him, though. Time. Healing ourselves. Okay, more attack speed, more crates. Hmm. More movement speed, obviously. Mm -hmm. The stupid horse hit me. Okay, cool. The problem of being too fast right now here. So. You can't move around that much while uh, in the Undertaker fight. You just limit your uh, movement a little bit. Get the shield. You might be able to kill him. Yes. Let's go. And that's how we actually uh, continue now. We're actually going to continue playing because I want to get Vampire and see how far we can get. I hope we get it out of this one. Please. No, we don't get... Every time you kill 30 enemies, gain 1% crit chance. You lose 50% of the buff when you take damage. I mean, that's not bad right now. To be honest. Like, any more. Things still are going to increase your attack speed. We don't need that. Um, mm -mm, okay. Let's do that. Every time we kill 30 enemies, we get 1% crits. Same. More movement speed. Hmm. More area effect. Oh, not damaged. Not good. There's a lot of enemies coming now. Like, obviously, always after the Undertaker, it's like hard to survive. Um, because there's like so much going on. If we get Vampire though, it's gonna be insane. Our deal area damage is trying to dash. Hmm. When your current health is even uh, an even number, gain 20% more damage. Nah, not so good. We'll take this. Uh, when we dash, we do area damage. Wow. That's not what I expected. That's pretty big. Holy shit. Where's the one guy that I want to kill? Okay. Give me something crazy, please. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, deal your raw damage as an area effect. Each time your projectile inflict a critical strike. That's not good. Uh, that's not good. It would be crazy, but it doesn't, doesn't work with us because we don't have 100% crit. Only if we dash, and dashing does the damage to us. Well, more or less. That's good, though. 
because it's going to remove all the enemies around us. So, it's giving me a chest. Nice. Actually, it didn't give me a chest because it's probably too far away. Where is it now? Where's the chest? There it is. He didn't die. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, your shots come back. Okay, no, we got. So let's go with the deputy now. It's going to give us 1000 damage, crazy. So we full HP now. Look at that. So. Let's go. Give me more damage. Death recover this time is reduced by 50% when moving. Oh no, that's actually what I want. Wait, what? What did I. What was the other thing that I got? This one is. Reduce the cooldown of your dashes by 100 dashing through enemies, deal that. Oh! Well, that's crazy, actually. No, this is nuts. Holy shit, look at that. Okay, guys, but at this point, you know, guys, we have to finish at some point. I think we'll end it here. <laughs> it's time to die. Let's see how long it takes for us to die, actually. Because if we move around like that, it's never going to end. And, you know, at this point, uh, it's hard. It's hard, guys. It's hard. We're not going to, it's not going to, there's not going to happen anything. It just takes extremely long to kill us, even though. Like crazy. Look at that. We healed. Put the ash now. So on top of that, like, look, we just heal. <laughs> okay, let's run in. And uh, thank you very much for playing and watching, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And we dead. Finally! Oh my god, what a score! Okay, well that was wonderfully. Hope you guys enjoyed this, uh, this episode. I'll definitely cut it together a little bit for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys, you know, in the next episode.